Compost is more than just a pile of kitchen scraps and yard waste. It's a bustling micro-ecosystem where insects play a pivotal role in turning organic matter into the dark, fertile soil every gardener dreams of. Yet many gardeners struggle with the question, which insects are truly beneficial for composting, and which ones are signs of trouble? Knowing how to identify and manage these insects can be the difference between a thriving compost system and one that attracts pests or stalls decomposition. This guide will walk you through the essential insects that make compost healthy, the warning signals from problematic invaders, and practical steps to keep your compost balanced and productive. The Unsung Heroes Beneficial Insects of Compost Compost thrives thanks to a community of hard-working insects and other tiny creatures that break down organic matter. The most famous of these are compost worms such as red wigglers. Unlike regular earthworms found in garden soil, these worms specialize in consuming kitchen scraps and yard debris, converting them into nutrient-rich castings. They are the ultimate decomposers, eating their weight daily and aerating the compost with their tunneling which encourages airflow and microbial activity. Millipedes, often mistaken for pests, are actually valuable allies. These many-legged creatures feast on decaying plant material and create tunnels in the compost that improve aeration and drainage. Their presence is a sign of a healthy compost environment rich in organic matter. So bugs or wood lice may look like armored little tanks roaming your compost heap, but they are essential decomposers. They feed on dead plant material and help break it down further, speeding up the composting process. Alongside them, tiny springtails spring into action in moist compost environments, munching on fungi and decaying matter, contributing to nutrient cycling. One of the less visible but remarkably efficient players in compost are the soldier fly larvae. These larvae can consume large amounts of organic waste quickly, making them invaluable in breaking down food scraps, especially when compost piles tend to get overwhelmed with kitchen waste. When good insects signal a problem. While the presence of many insects is a good sign, some indicate that something in your compost pile needs attention. For instance, Fruit flies may seem harmless, but an abundance of them often points to food scraps left exposed on the surface or excessive moisture. They thrive in soggy conditions where the balance between browns, carbon-rich materials and greens, nitrogen-rich scraps, has tipped too far. Maggots are another decomposer that can appear in compost. While they do consume decaying matter, a large number of maggots typically signals that your compost is too wet or overloaded with food scraps especially meat or dairy, which ideally shouldn't be composted at home. Cockroaches, unwelcome visitors in any compost bin, usually appear when there's a moisture problem, or if the compost contains greasy or dairy products. Their presence suggests the compost needs better management to prevent these pests from thriving. Ants can be both friends and foes. A few ants indicate that your compost is dry as they prefer drier environments, However, large colonies might be drawn to sugary or protein-rich scraps, suggesting food placement in the pile needs adjustment. Additionally, excessive dryness slows down decomposition. Balancing Act – How to Manage Compost Insects The key to managing insects in your compost lies in maintaining a balance of materials and moisture, along with proper compost care. First, balancing greens and browns is fundamental. Greens provide nitrogen, which fuels microbial growth, while browns provide carbon and structure, preventing the pile from becoming compacted and soggy. A well-balanced pile discourages pests and supports beneficial decomposers. Food scraps should be buried beneath a layer of brown materials such as dried leaves or shredded paper. This not only reduces odors that attract flies and cockroaches but also encourages decomposition deeper in the pile where it's hotter and more efficient. Moisture control is critical. Compost should feel like a wrung-out sponge, moist but not waterlogged. Overwatering leads to anaerobic conditions that encourage flies, maggots, and foul smells, while too little moisture slows decomposition and attracts ants. Turning the compost regularly ensures air penetrates the pile, preventing compaction. Aeration supports aerobic microbes that produce heat and break down material faster. This active environment keeps problematic insects at bay. Using a well-fitting lid on your compost bin can keep out larger pests like cockroaches and rodents while still allowing for airflow. If you're composting outdoors in a heap, consider covering it with a tarp during heavy rains to prevent saturation. P. 
periodic cleaning of compost bins, especially those used for kitchen scraps, helps prevent buildup of residues that attract insects. It also gives you a chance to check moisture levels and mix the pile thoroughly. The Bigger Picture Insects as Indicators of Compost Health Insects and compost are not just workers, they're also messengers. Their presence and behavior can tell you a lot about the condition of your compost. An abundance of beneficial decomposers means your pile is well-balanced and active. In contrast, a surge of flies, maggots, or cockroaches is a clear signal to adjust moisture, aeration, or food scraps. Learning to read these signals gives gardeners a powerful tool to fine-tune their composting process. Compost is a living system that needs care and observation, just like any other garden bed. By working with nature's helpers and understanding their needs, you turn scraps into garden gold. Final Thoughts Cultivating a Healthy Compost Ecosystem Composting is a journey, and the insects within your pile are key partners in this transformation. By fostering an environment that supports beneficial insects and discourages pests, your compost will break down faster, smell better, and yield richer soil amendments. Remember that balance, moisture control, proper food scrap management, and aeration are the pillars of healthy compost. Don't be discouraged by the occasional unwelcome visitor. Instead, use their presence to learn and adjust. Composting is an ever-evolving process, and with patience and observation, you will master it. If you found this guide helpful, be sure to subscribe to Hydrohaven for more practical gardening wisdom. Share this video with fellow gardeners who want to unlock the full potential of their compost. Healthy soil starts with healthy compost, and healthy compost starts with understanding the life within it.